What's up, YouTube? Starting off the day super late. Actually, I'm not starting off the day. I'm just opening the video super late. I'm actually, uh, I got a request on one of my YouTube comments from you guys. Uh, let me see who requested it. I forget who did it. Nick Horton, I think I Horton, Horton, H Horton, requested that I do a station update video for 2019. So I'm gonna show you guys my workstation. A lot of you guys know I sticker bombed it. It looks dope, it looks crazy. But I'm gonna break down, you know, what I'm using, why I'm using this, stuff like that. So let's get started. Let's go. Okay, so first things first, my name is the Barber TZ. If you're not a part of the team, make sure to hit that red subscribe button and join the team. And uh we do videos every day, so let's get it. We're gonna start right here on my back bar, okay? So I have my high level, low level, my square, contact, um, like I can take Apple Pay, chip reader, stuff like this. This was 50 bucks, um, great investment though. Um, this one is my swiper. Now a quick, a quick little note for um, square. I learned this recently. If you use the swiper and somebody disputes it, square will automatically rule with them. If you use the chip, Square will um, work a little bit more in your favor to kind of help defend uh, fraudulent stuff. I have heard of people getting haircuts and literally like, just disputing the charge as soon as they bounce out and Square reimburses them their money. It hasn't happened to me personally, but it, it is a thing. So just a heads up on that. Back to the station thing. So got my batteries charging here. I have this cool power strip that I have everything plugged into. It has two USB ports, so I can charge my camera batteries or my cell phone, um, whichever one. So um, my 245 certificate, my godson Lyric, my um, station, not my station, my licenses, uh, my boy Eddie, Shiro, hand painted the sign for me, Cash is King. Got my next strips hanging on the wall, and uh, got my Saints, you already know what it is. We're going to the bowl, baby. These are my Andes Purple Guards, my Double Magnets. I never use them, so they're up here. This is my Barberology Knife and Flag Cape um, that I got at Las Vegas Barber Expo. This thing is amazing. This is what I use 100% of the time now. Keep my clips on there, everything. My Babilis Pro. I forget the model. I'll find it. Um, my Babilis Blow Dryer. I'm saving up to get the Dyson, but this is my Babilis one. It's pretty dope. Just dropped the battery. Pretty dope, but I like this a lot. I'm dropping everything, yo. What is going on? Oh, it's because I got it on the retractor cord. Okay, anyways. Um, this is my ring light for when I take pictures with my phone. This just clips over your cell phone and then you can illuminate that. Quick and easy. Sticker bombs everywhere on the toolbox. I forget the brand of the toolbox, but we'll start down here. This is like my all my finishing tools. So I have my oil sheen, my hairspray, my gel, my alcohol, um, stuff like that. A couple boxes of things that I have on my station. Child's booster seat. Um, I have witch hazel, uh, bay rum, barber size in the back, um, all that stuff. So now we're gonna come up here to the top. Obviously, the Andis purple guards. That's what I use for guards. The uh, Tomb 45 beard and lineup enhancement, uh, aka the no drip. That's there. Uh, Denman Neck Duster. The reason I use this one is because these are synthetic brushes. These are fully submersible in Barberside and will not break down. Uh, Beam Team Cordless Compressor. I used to use this every single day. However, my top lid, I dropped it and it broke and cracked right along. I'm focused right along the edge of this. I'm waiting for them to send me a replacement piece. That'll be in soon. So I'm using my, app, my master. Take this off here. My master airbrush, which is there. Uh, the airbrush stays on all the time, and then when I when I fire it up, it turns on. This is my leather wrapped scissor case. All my scissors and shears are in there. Uh, my Andis Slimline Pro LIs with the T outliner blade on there. I have a video I'll link below on how to modify that and put that blade on there. My wall retro tea cuts. These things are hitters. They're not that good for balding out, but they are amazing. Um, all of these clippers and everything that I use that I can find on Amazon will be linked below for purchase if you guys want to use them. So retro tea cuts are dope. Um, the legendary 
Braun Series 9s with the charging and cleaning base. I'm out of fluid, I need to replace that. So that is a must do on the checklist. And it's Cool Care for in between cuts. Topics hair fibers with the pump. All right, this is my aftershave. This is not the brand I use, Nairo, Nairobi. It's an aftershave, just keep it in my pump. These are all my facial products. 24 karat gold peptide infused facial serum, hemp oil, jojoba oil, coconut oil for the skin, and lay right bay rum. Those are typically what I use for my facials. Obviously I have the 245 shave gel, my sharps container, um, this is my Kiss Expression station over here. So I have two bottles of Kiss. I have a pre-mixed bottle of Kiss Expressions with alcohol. Lay right grooming spray. I have Paul Mitchell Super Skinny Serum. I use that for a heat treatment when I put it in the hair before I blow dry. Um, these are all beard oils that my boy Charles, the guy that I did that head shave on not so long ago. These are all his handmade beard oils. Very special to me, I keep them right there. Um. Now I guess we can. Now I guess we can tackle the. Uh, oh, let me shout out my cousin Robert. Maybe this ornament for Christmas this year, hand handmade with metal. It's super dope. Anyways, now let's tackle the drawers. So uh, which one do you want to go to first? That one. Cool. Let's go. So right here is uh, clippers and razors. Obviously, I have the gold Fabulous FX cordless. Charging up, wall senior cordless, the uh, magic clip cordless. I'm gonna actually switch this to a balding clipper, so I'll have a video on that soon. I'm gonna remove this leather, this leather, <laughs> this lever, put a balding clipper on here. This is gonna be my wall, my cordless balding clipper. A little, little brush in here to clean the, clean the teeth off of the clipper in between haircuts. My Tum 45 straight razor. Derby Professionals, I use these because they are super cheap and they are sharp enough for what I use them for. Next drawer, my combs and specialty guards. So I bought this um, like silverware drawer liner. It works really well for keeping my combs and stuff organized and not just like flopping around in here. And it keeps them in a clean location tucked away in the drawer. Um, I also use my, this piece right here, where you normally put whatever in here. For my specialty guards, my Speedos, my wall premiums, all this stuff, my Babyliss guards that I use. So that says there. This is a 3D Barber hair gripper. Again, this can be fully submerged in low level to sanitize. That's that. Oh, my back is hurting. Okay, on to the next drawer. I'm trying to like tuck this cord up here real quick so we can get a good. Okay, so on to the next drawer, second drawer. This is my combs, brushes, gloves, talc powder, um, some Nivea hand cream for my hands. Uh, product here, boom, lay right. I have lay right and I have 245. We have a back bar of products that we use for the shop. So I have like Suavecito and uh, stuff like that. This is my business cards. These are my current business cards. Uh, current business cards. And uh, these are my old ones that I use for doing lineups and stuff with the airbrush. So super, super resourceful and recycling. Uh, brushes real quick. Conair vented brush, super easy for like getting through really thick hair. Uh, Denman brush, couple round brushes, pretty easy. Now this is the drawer. Every barber, every barber has the drawer. Everything goes in this damn drawer. So I'm gonna break down what's on the top layer. We ain't digging no deeper. That's it, okay? So first things first, we have our Braun traveling case. Whenever I do house calls, my Braun shavers go into this so that any, the foils do not get damaged. First things first, okay? Uh, I know I said I was gonna leave it in the top layer, but I like these, so. My Filipino 10 inch shears, these things are monsters. They do need to be sharpened though. A um, couple of different products in here that companies have sent me try out this is my oster hand facial massager neck massager whatever you want to massage with it um, it's very old as you can tell by the plug super old works like a champ though 
so I use that. Mod Clean is the barber side that I use. I um, showed it in one of my videos. I'll do a whole video on it, but uh, pretty much you take these out. They're pre-measured little packets. You put it in 32 ounces of water, let it dissolve, mix it up. That's what that is. Um, next we have um, my facial scrubber stuff. I keep it in a plastic bag to keep hair off of it. And it's like that, so that's in that. I have all my brush heads, pumice stone, so like that in there. A couple of old shears, a couple of old clippers, some lights, some bean boozled for the kids. I like to, I like to make them eat and rotten jelly beans. So that's cool. That's the drawer though. And then uh, we're gonna step back a little bit. I have a newer ring light. This is linked below also. Um, and then I have recently purchased the uh, I'm just gonna call it the the double razor uh, Illusion Ghost Print Cape. Showing up really well on camera though. I love it. So this is my cape. Super dope. A little bit low key compared to like the red one you always see with people using. So I like that. Overall, that is my station though. Pretty, pretty simple. So uh, yeah. So right here I have a trash can. And then this is where my used towels go. And then, man, I can't think of anything else. So. I guess that's the video. If you have any questions or anything like that, check the description. There will be links for everything that I typically use. And then um, drop a comment. You know the drill, man. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. I got two tutorials I'm gonna do up this week. So uh, yeah, hit the red subscribe button. I will see you tomorrow. Peace. What's up YouTube, it's the Barber Teasing, and I appreciate you watching this video. If you guys like the content and you wanna see more of it, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button right in the middle, my little face thing, wherever it is right here. Hit that and subscribe and join the team. If you guys liked this video, hit the like button for your boy, and if you wanna check out more content that I've made, click on this video here or uh, this video here, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.